Hello everyone, my name is Sean Mancini and today we're learning how to create and apply a Bogon access list. What is a Bogon access list? Well the first first things first, uh, the Bogon list or the least the one I get is uh, uh, you can go into team uh, kimru.org. Uh, they are a network security site just like I but um, they deal, they track uh, lists such as this and provide them free on the internet so to as well as if you go to my site uh, shamancini.com uh, there will be a link for this exact same list now this list is a list of IPs that are either non routable IPs or IPs that have not been leased to someone else uh, so for instance if a block of IPs don't belong to anyone that I there should be no traffic originating from that IP because no one owns it uh, as such there's other IPs that should not be coming in this would be more of like a internet facing router or uh, something like that so for instance from the internet coming into the WAN I should not be seeing IPs in 127.0.0.0 subnet because as we know that's a local host or an internal range same as 192.168 range okay um, that is a, pri a private range as well I shouldn't be seeing traffic from some other computer on the internet trying to come in because at that time most most likely that's a spoofed address now if you're running a point-to-point -point link or something like that and not internet, f internet facing then you most likely will not need this okay so with this info uh, I've created a s uh, small access list. All you really do is just copy this, and to make it easy for yourself, you'll just do access list dash 101, and here we go. Uh, and then finish access list dash access dash list space 101 deny IP, and then put all all the IPs in the range any. Okay. So now to apply this list. It's very simple. After you have this list, which I'll apply, I will paste this in the description below. You will then just go to a computer on your uh, sorry to your router. In my case, let's go to my lab router. Now, first of all, first things first, oh, we'll have to create the access list once my goof up finishes. But I will just do this because it's actually faster. Hi, oh, I beat the router. Okay, so go enter into. Uh, global configuration mode and you can simply just copy and paste this okay first make sure there's no access list that's already named 101 okay in my case I already have one okay but I don't actually need it so And now I will install my new access list. Done. Okay. And now let's apply the access list. Okay. So, which interface would you apply this to? Obviously, um, we want to apply this to the WAN facing port. Okay. So in this case, my WAN facing port would be 2.1, as an example. Okay. So I would apply this to F0 slash 1. Okay, you'll put IP access group 101, and we want to block inbound traffic. In. And that is how we 
that is how we create and apply a Bogon access list. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in my videos as they do help. Any suggestions for future videos are also appreciated. You can also visit my website, www.seanmancini.com. Thank you for watching, everyone.